Hey guys, Sapphire Truth here, and today I'm back with another video. I know it's been a while. I uh, don't stream a lot or make videos a lot, but whenever I get a chance and I feel like doing it, I will. So today I thought I'd try and go back and play some World Box and uh, I don't know, have some fun with it. I haven't played it in a while, so we'll just have to see what we can do, I guess. Have the front wars and stuff. So, uh, yeah. If you haven't seen World Box in a long time, it's definitely changed since the last time you've seen my videos. And uh, if you don't know what it is, it's a God Simulator game. And I mean, just watch and you'll find out. And then the description will have all the downloads and everything for you. So We got ourselves a big world here. And uh, I like to call this satellite mode. And then this is close mode. What does that mean? What? Alrighty. I did not even know that was a thing, but I guess it's traits, it's being peaceful, so. Interesting. But we still do got some animals around here that are just free roaming here. This one has no traits. So before I started this, um, well, they definitely changed a lot of the pictures. I went to World Laws and I turned on and off the stuff that I wanted, so... Yeah. Everything seems fine. Except I want these on and that. We don't want peaceful monsters. And lava will probably cool into rock. I mean, if I want to change that later, I will. Okay. Alrighty, let me see here. So we now got our world history. Nothing. And there is. Something in here that I wanted to click on, but I don't know what it is. What? Okay, so that's new. Alright. Um, I know I saw it somewhere. Hold on. Show all major events the moment they happen. I'm not sure what that's going to do, but we'll see. All right, we'll show boats. We'll show all the cities and stuff. And borders. Got it. So we'll speed this up to F5. It's a little loud, but what is that? Oh, thunderstorm. Got it. Alrighty. Well, I'm going to start placing down people. We'll have different races, so. Oh, shoot. Wrong button. Right here, I was thinking about. Turn that down more. Oh, see, that tells me up here. Okay, that's great. We'll have this. And uh, seems they're fighting the wolves right now. Will they survive? We'll give them more people. Let's see if they survive. Oh, that's the king, I'm guessing. What is that? All hail the king. We'll put the elves all the way down here. In this little island right here. And then right over here, we'll put the dwarves. And yeah, we'll just see who wins in the end, if there's a war or not. You know, whoever wants to live. There's the orcs. Got it. So here's our three kingdoms. Let's see what this is. They're right now going in that direction. This looks like the dwarves. So is this. Alrighty, 
believe they got another one. They're just really going on getting all these things set up here. They've got most of the globe. These guys are explorers. Alrighty. Have they met up with anybody else? Where's the elves? Still living on this island? Do they not know how to get across? Guessing not. So... I'll just put this here then. Alrighty, well, it looks like we got enough for every race, I think. What about them? They've still got nothing, because I guess they don't know how to go across the water. Oh, that's right, they need boats first. Forgot they updated that. They used to just be able to swim short distances, but I guess that's not a thing anymore, so... Yeah. Can favorite units. Alrighty. Let's check out. Hmm. Wait, no. Where does it tell you? The war status. So here's all the different ones we've got. Sweet. There we go. So all of them are good. They look neutral right now. Oh, they're in alliance with everyone. That's who we clicked on. So nobody seems to be at war right now, which is good. The world's just prospering right now. Some of them might not even know each other. So, yeah. Oh, destroyed by who? Yikes. There is a fire going on in the town. Can they survive? The new king? Looks like they're uh, pulling through pretty good. There's another fire over here, though, that's starting up. All right, well, everywhere else seems to be fine. They look pretty advanced. What is that guy? So he has a huge sword. He's paranoid and he's wise. <laughs> he's seen some stuff. Hunger. They need food. So is that their mood right there? I'm guessing. I don't know, but... They seem to be doing fine, I guess. Not another thunderstorm. Seems they've gotten another village. Alrighty. Well, seems we got... Alrighty. Just a lot of new things I haven't really seen before. See what we can add to this world, though. Alrighty, right here in the middle of nowhere, we're gonna sprout up this, which they changed how it looks. I actually think the new design is actually better. And they can walk along the ice, so these will probably be aliens. In the center of here, they'll have a flame tower. Oh, shoot. <laughs> I didn't know it did that. Well, it shoots fireballs. Is this like the Eye of Sauron? Well, they're actually prospering very good over here, so we'll have to see how they combat this. I'll place a... A little bit of sand here. These people, where did they all go? Did they all move over the ocean? 
They have boats now, so maybe. Sweet, alright. Any other boats around the ocean? Those are just bugs. It seems we're entering the explorer age, I'm guessing. But over here we're having some terrible disasters, so... Yikes. Ooh, Artsa. What's this all about? That's the demon? Oh, <laughs> so these towns are becoming ravaged. Well, I guess we'll have to see if anyone can defeat the demons then. This, that's not good. Alrighty, well, everyone else around here, though, seems to be doing pretty good. The ice creatures don't seem to be affecting anybody. Here's a ship. Where'd that go? It's traveling along the coast here. It's a different kind, so I'm wondering if it's just upgraded or what. It's looking for other docks to meet with people, I'm assuming. There we go. Alright, hold on. Let me pause time here for a second. Looks like a swan. And, uh, okay, so this is, uh, six years old. And it's... Uh, elvish. Jeez. This one's 11 years old, though, so I'm wondering if it's just the kind of species that creates it. Alrighty, who's this going out here to fight someone? Oh, it's just a fire, probably. The Washi. That's not good. So, seems great disaster has plagued this area. No one lives here anymore. And they seem to be prospering now. Okay, they're making some more progress. What's he doing? Trying to find somewhere new or... I'm not really sure, but all right. Demons that make their way just a little bit. Who's this? That's more of them. Oh, does the color of the house depend on the color of the nation? Same with the flags here. I never really thought about that, but I guess I can tell where stuff comes from now. Interesting. Alrighty, so yeah, they're all doing pretty good, I guess I would say, but no wars right now, it seems. They're all trading, which is good. Let me click on this. Yeah, it seems everybody's doing great. Alrighty. Let's see what disaster we can plague. Seems to have more movement than before. Want some tornadoes in this area here. While we're at it, we'll earthquake it up. There we go. Now they're on their own island. Alrighty, well... I think I'd just like to see who survived the longest now with all the disasters happening and everything, so. And you know what? Let me see where that's at. We'll just keep the lava. And uh, see how destruction plays out.
see who survives, I guess. I really hate this. Uh, Why is it so loud? I don't know if it's loud to you guys, but... And this area will start a tumor. They already killed it already. And I'll start one here. Some alien looking tumor, I guess. What the heck? Hold up. What is that? The living tumor? Is that what the mushrooms are? Uh, I have no idea. But it seems that they are surviving quite well. I wonder what happens if I put coffee on some people here. Will everybody go fast suddenly? I probably haven't reached much people, so... This will make people plunge into that. Alrighty, well, looks like we got quite a fair share of people living here. I love the Conway Game of Life. If you've never played it, you should. Oh, that's just to turn things into zombies. Alright, we got a zombie virus happening. Wow. They are doing very well got a whole coliseum whatever that is and then they got their own temple nice haven't really checked up on most of these some new ones and then here's the old ones <laughs> nice somebody's dying over here why is this People are going mad probably because of this, I'm assuming. We'll spread a little bit of this randomly. And you know, we'll have a disease as well, because why not? Alrighty. Um, trying to see what else I can add here. Evil Mage. They make skeletons grow out of the ground. It seems nobody can take down that tower though, so unless they're able to do so, I don't think they're getting anywhere. And we got snowmen over here. And, uh, you know, you might as well, when you have the chance, do something a little bit like this. There we go. Things just clenching into madness now. <laughs> just fighting itself. Bruh. The plague doctor, I'm gonna guess, is this the person that causes the plague or helps the plague? Whatever it is, you're here now. I'm just trying to see what all we can uh, do in this big all world right here. So, uh,
whoever can survive the longest, I'm guessing. So have fun, you know what I say. I remember when they first added a lot of this stuff. These people up here are surviving the longest. They've gotten away from most of this crap. Right now, though, it doesn't seem like it's going too well for them. There's still people in boats, though, if they can survive and get somewhere. And they might be safe. See, he's trying to build some stuff back up, or her. They are trying to build some more stuff up. Um, I don't know what else to play here, to be honest. I think it just caused just chaos, I guess. It's a little too late for me to fix my problems that I've caused. That's a pretty big bomb, and that's what it does. You actually see him be dropped now. Hmm. Um. I honestly don't know what to do from here. So, uh. A famous reference. And, uh, because, why not? <laughs> That's pretty cool. Crabzilla. If only we could have used this during, uh, War of... I forgot what it was called. That old tournament we used to do, Tournament of the Races or something. Battle of the Races. Alright, well. Let's now have some satisfying fun here. Alrighty, well, that's probably going to be all for me today. I know that wasn't much, but I just want to play around for a little bit. So if you guys had fun watching it or want to see something else, just make sure to tell me. And uh, yeah, all right.